sum of the random sample of a random sample. When the sample is drawn, definitely we need some, some sort of summary statistic. Summary statistic may basically have a mean bhi hota hai, standard deviations bhi hota hai. Aur jaisa ki aapko pata hai ki summary statistic ko, kyunki ye sample quantity hai, aur ye ham sample se calculate karte hai, to generally ham isko in term of function represent karte hai. That is t of x1, x2 up to xn. Aur ye jo humare paas function hota hai, iski domains jo hoti hai, wo humare paas jo random variable ki space hoti hai, wohi humare paas iski domain hoti hai. The function Generally, जो है हमारे पास इसको real valued function से हम define करते हैं या ये real vectored function भी इसको हम कहला ये इसको कहते हैं क्योंकि जो हमारे पास ये function जो होता है ये real valued function होता है तो definitely it follows some sort of probability structure क्योंकि हमारे पास जो random sample आते हैं वो iid random sample होते हैं और जो अब iid random sample होंगे तो it means it follows some sort of certain probability structure जब certain probability structures को ये follow करेंगे, तो generally ऐसी situation में जो हमारे पास distribution बनेगी, उसको हम sampling distribution of y के नाम से y के नाम से जानेंगे। और और ये जो जो distribution है, basically it also distinguishes between the sampling distribution of y and the probability uh, and the population distribution. इससे generally होता क्या है कि population की जो distribution है उसको हम study करना हमारे लिए बड़ा मुश्किल होता है तो हम sample से उसकी distributions बनाते हैं और उसको उसे study करते हैं definition इसकी जो है that is let x1, x2, x10 be a random sample of size n from a population and let t x1, x2 up to xn be a real valued or real vector function whose domain is also the random variables then the random variable or random vector y that is equal to t1, t into x1, x2 up to xn is called the statistic. This probability distribution of statistic y is called the sampling distribution of y.